Internalization. This is the key. I say this all the time. You are Neo. What did Morpheus say? You are the one. Who does Neo represent? Christ. Gnostically. Christ energy. Therefore, you are Jesus Christ. If you read the Bible and read it as you are the main character, sauce. Read it as if you Jesus. And then decode it with the messages. You're going to be like, oh, this man's walking on water. He, he's over, he's, he surpasses his, his emotions. Turning water into wine. This man doing alchemy. You do alchemy. It's not literal. This is all it's symbolic. If you want to get deep, Jesus is also Lucifer, the morning star. Who is Lucifer? The fallen angel. Fallen angel. Fallen angle. Angle of light. Angles, light. You are light, Christ. I got to put that in the song. You are light, Christ. You are light, Christ. But he fell. Where did he fall from? Sandman showed him as the as she. They're truly an androgynous energy, truly. They say they fell from heaven. And it's crazy, before I started tapping in with Lucifer, I, I made a song called Fell From Heaven. Crazy. The spiritual alignments. Heaven is beyond the matrix. Beyond this physical realm. Beyond the realms of time. Beyond y'all de broth. From a higher dimension to this third dimensional plane. See, and see, they call it a plane. See, I'm going to correspond plane to boat. Both modes of transportation. And I say boat because now we're going to Kemet. The boat of Ra. All the deities. The boat of Ra. Read the story, but read it as you are Ra. Traveling through time. Upper world. The underworld. That's nighttime. Conscious mind. Subconscious mind. Meets up with Osiris. Lord of the underworld. Subconscious. That's the first place to go to. Then he fights with Apophis. It's a snake. Kundalini energy. All these stories go back to you in the science of you. Because you are a star. Just like the stars you look up to. As above, so below. You look up at stars at night. You look up at stars at night on TV. On the movie screen. When it's dark. Hey, nah, nah. This is really the key of life. Because look. Look at the key of life. Look at it. It's literally representing you. See? Y'all can't tell me that's not a human body.